Hi guys, so a real quick tutorial for you today. First up we're going to need a Phillips head screwdriver. Next we're going to need a soldering iron, no greater than 40 watts. After that we're going to need a little bit of solder. And then lastly we're going to need a RCA jack. I highly recommend using an RCA panel mount jack instead of a cable like I'm using here because it'll make the install much neater. Okay, the first thing we need to do is remove both the controllers and just move them away out of the way. Then next we're going to flip the system over and take out the battery door and then remove the four screws, two underneath the battery door and two on the bottom here. Now flip the console over and undo the retention clips, they should all just snap out of place and then remove the top of the console. Once you have the console apart, locate the video and ground pins on the RF module. Now this next step is really simple, just push back the coax cable and solder the center wire or center pin of your RCA connector to the video pin and the ground wire just goes to the ground pin. Now that that's all done, just put the bottom back on and screw in the four screws, put the battery cover back on and you're ready to play. So if you enjoyed this tutorial, please don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Hi guys, thanks for watching my video. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe, it really helps me out. Also you can find me on Twitter and on my website, I'll put the links in the description. Thanks again and I'll see you in my next video.